Hello everyone, not too far from some of the great attractions in the Los Angeles area. We're at Dignity Health Sports Park in Southern California. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's the United States versus France. Well, Derek, we're looking forward to this game. You can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the field, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Here's how it looks for the United States. Christian Pulisic starts with Giovanni Reina out wide, and in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Ousmane Dembele plays with Kingsley Coman out wide. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. And the contest begins. Something to worry about here. Pivotal moment defensively. Oh, a nice looking pass. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick though here. Well, the short corner routine. Coman. Rabio, And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out the situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such oh, a Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! And still danger here. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Well, so close to getting that early goal there. But it was a wonderful save by the keeper, you have to say. Can they create something from here? A fine reading of the situation. Aurelien Chouameni. And that was a very fine read. Dembele. Now options are plenty. Coman. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Mbappe. Smuggled away. And a textbook interception. Come on! Now oh, keeper in control. And taken short. Griezmann, and the flag has gone up, offside. <laughs> 
Koman. And possession lost, intercepted. Koman might be a chance here. And no problems at all for the keeper. Dembele. Back to Mbappe. Koman! And it was a great chance for 1 0. Well, that should have been the opener, shouldn't it? What a chance that was. Well, no surprise there. France have enjoyed most of the possession, but without really creating too many chances. Which, when you look at the players out on the pitch, it's really disappointing. They need to play with far more urgency to win this game. Well, can they regain possession first and be more creative with the ball? Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it fizzled out. Weston McKenney. Konate. Now Rabio. Dembele. Now let's see what they can do here. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Pulisic. McKenney. A wonderful intervention. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Beautifully weighted ball. And Coman distributing shrewdly. Well, the post got in the way. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Mbappe, in with a chance, and the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. Playing it in, still not clear. Griezmann. On to Coman. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Just failing to hit the target with his pass, and it'll be a throw-in. Aurelien Chouameni. Promising attack, this. Coman. Did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Tempele. Now with Mbappe. It did look on for them, but not to be. 30 minutes to go then. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Might take the lead. And there is the opening goal. Well, arguably against the run of play. They've been second best up to this point. But they have the lead. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box. Which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Mbappe. Chouameni. And France pushing forward with options available. 
and slipped through beautifully. Griezmann, Rabio, and a goal! An end to end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Goal. So underway Goal again France. here on the Number back of 14. that leveller. Adrian Rabio. Giovanni Reina on the offensive and in with a real chance and a goal just like that they're back in front well here's the replay the little one two starts everything off and once he gets onto it he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique what an emphatic finish that is. Goal! What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? McKinney. Gives it a go. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. And in the end, no damage done. Well, that would certainly have put them in a great position. But with only a one-goal lead, they're never going to be able to relax. Well, they can't dwell on not getting the rub of the green. Perhaps they... And a goal! A quick one, too! And they've turned this oh, game on its head! see the weight of the through ball is key to this goal and then the shot could not be hit any better struck with such venom great goal so the ball is moving again we've been treated to four goals three one the score Dembele Aurelien Chouameni Dangerous looking through ball. Weston McKenney. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Almost found its target, but cutting it out in the end. Well, it's great when you can rely on your keeper. So now a corner. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Who can he pick out? On a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. Teammates available. And Pulisic has it. And that pass could be troublesome. Still a chance. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. And time for the change now. Adrian Rebio coming on to the pitch. Number 13, Yusuf Fofana. Yusuf Fofana. Hernandez. And full time, we can say it officially now, the United States have won. And Stuart, I wonder what you've made of their performance. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. 
Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.